for showing that there are things. We don't have to agree on everything. Nancy and I still don't agree on everything. Yeah. God knows. But we, <laughs> but we can agree on some things, and we can work together on some things, and we can find progress and, on some things. And that's, I think, what we really have to do, and that's what we're yeah. trying to do yeah. to push things well, forward. Well, it's been said that if two people on the same job agree all the time, then one's irrelevant. <laughs> okay, but if they disagree all the time, then they're both irrelevant. So uh, <laughs> anyway, but breast cancer is sort of like a Gordian knot. The more you know, the more you have to find out. But I think one thing Sue and I believe in and I totally agree on is that medical breakthroughs do not have to happen in a laboratory. They, 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 this is going to be yeah. a huge medical breakthrough. The, the idea that we're going to have crowdsourced information uh, as well as real testimony, unfiltered, uh, things that all of us sort of know and, as Sue said, are, haven't wanted to talk about, to touch it or smell it. And it's time now to deal with it. Also, as we do our work globally, and we've talked a lot about ideas we have, we don't have time to make the same mistakes we've made in the United States. The world still looks to us to lead. We have to do cancer therapy and other therapies for very long-term NCDs. We have to be smart about it. We can't yeah. build silos everywhere, over-invest over well, in things, and do the simple things the, well. The same thing, it's like we can't go to Africa and put up, right. say, well, you have to have telephone poles and telephone wires first before we'll let you have cell phones. <laughs> exactly. Well, we're sort of trying to do that when we try to move American medicine globally, the right. problems aren't the same, and the answers could be a lot better. In fact, they don't have the same Screw our, screwed up as incentives that our healthcare system has. So we could actually get more efficient, easier, cheaper ways to treat diseases by going there first and then bringing them back here, which in a way is what's happened a lot with cell technology as right. well. So we're really looking at ways not just to, to import everything we've done here, but to find new and creative solutions around the world. So we're hoping that this collaboration, which is really starting with, with, with these groups and starting on this particular project, will be the first step of trying to find other ways that we right. can collaborate right. as we move forward and as we try to, 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 to really eradicate breast cancer. Because Nancy and I are getting old. Yeah. And we're getting tired. <laughs> <laughs> yeah.